안녕하세요. 비키는 입니다. 안녕하세요. 라이블리 입니다. I think overall it, it, it was a great year. I had a lot of fun. Uh, it was cool to be in, just in a new country, a new league, facing new hitters, playing with new teammates. Um, I, I felt at home for, from the very beginning here uh, with the Samsung line. So I'm excited for a new year because last year was a lot of fun. I learned a lot. I feel like I improved in my game as a player. And uh, I, I look forward to this year is taking what I learned last year and building off of that to have a stronger season this year. I mean, a, a lot more rest this off season, just a lot more stretching than lifting, and just making sure my body is going to be more healthy for this season. Oh, absolutely. Uh, as a starting pitcher, um, as lively, I'm sure all starting pitchers can attest to, is that we have a lot of downtime because we only play, you know, once every six games. So to be in the dugout every game, you just try to find things to keep the energy up, to you know, stay behind your team, let them know that you're still having fun, enjoying the game. So I think having that kind of energy in the dugout, I think it's contagious to the rest of the players to keep them you know, happy and into the game and high energy. So yeah, I think it's a lot of fun uh, to do that in the dugout, but obviously you pick and choose your times to make sure you're doing it at the right point in the game. I, 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 I think Jose can, can be a big, can, can be a big asset because last year Saladino came and he was playing very well for us. He, uh, unfortunately with his back, he, he, he wasn't able to play. So that you know, took him out of the lineup, but he was a big part of our lineup um, defensively and offensively. So I think if Jose can really solidify that outfield spot and, and be consistent in the plate, I think he can be a, a big part to this lineup and add that extra strength um, to, to give us that much more depth. Uh, and as far as a pitcher, um, I don't know. I, I, I think pitching is kind of hard to single out anyone because every game different guys are throwing, and it, it's, it's kind of hard to do that because you rely on a lot of people. Uh, but hopefully this year we'll give um, we'll give O a, a lot of you know save opportunities so that if he can stay healthy and do what he's known know what he's known for um, and he can shut the door for everyone I think he'd be a big part for us too. And for me I think the position player for me is Hakju. You know like he had a up and down year last year and um, a little injury but you know he's a great glove to have behind you and mm -hmm. when he's hitting he's hitting and it's definitely a fun at bat and. Love to watch throughout the whole game, the whole season, whenever he's there. And pitching wise, you know, like, I mean, I feel like we battle, like the starters battle, but just not just a single person, but I think a lot of the young guys, when they come up here to get that opportunity to take advantage of it, because they come in here a lot of big times. When I was hurt last year and we were in the, we were in the top of the um, league last year, and you know, it just seemed like towards the end of the year, we started going down in the bullpen. But if we solidify that bullpen, give O an opportunity to get the save, we're just going to be 10 times better all the way around. I know who he is. I've never faced him, though. But, like, when I first got drafted with Cincinnati, he was in Cincinnati. I mean, like, I saw him in spring training and stuff like that, but never got to face him. And I never pitched against the Rangers when he was with them. But definitely know who he is. Same here, man. I, I know the name, uh, Mr. Bean over here, he's been talked up a lot, but I've, I never had the chance to, to face him. Staying healthy, you know, getting through the whole season and staying strong throughout the whole year, then if that happens, everything else should be taken care of. Yeah, I mean, you can't have a better answer than that. I mean, the biggest thing, especially as a starting pitcher, is t to take the ball every time it's your turn to go on the mound. So you stay healthy. You know, you, you give your team a chance to win, and so as long as, like Ben just said, stay healthy, take the ball every time. Hopefully, from work ethic and routines and stuff like that, everything else take care of itself. Yeah, I mean, to 2021, uh, last season's last season. Uh, last season was good, but all I can say is that we hope this year's better. We hope there's a lot more opportunities to interact with you guys and you know see you at the games, see you outside the field. Uh, but yeah, I mean, 2021, we're very excited for it. We're working hard. We're getting ready. But we really look forward to uh, playing for you guys this year. Yeah, I can't wait to see you guys at Lions Park. You know, last year it's kind of boring without any cheer songs going on. And I want to hear the cheer songs going and get me fired up just so I can get that strikeout when we need it and get the win. Uno, dos y tres. Oñaseo, Pirela y Mida. Bueno, me parece bien. Eh, todavía no he tenido la oportunidad de enfrentar a todos los equipos, pero hasta ahora todo me parece muy bien. La verdad no, no, no tuve esa oportunidad de que alguien me comentara sobre la liga, pero sí había tenido conocimiento, había visto muchos juegos así en videos y 
pero no tuve comunicación con alguien que, que me diera referencias de esta liga. Eh, gracias a Dios me he estado preparando muy bien. Creo que con el transcurso de los días me siento mejor y mejor. Y pues ya ansioso por que empiece la temporada y salir al terreno del juego a jugar. Todo, todo. Eh, creo que el equipo me da un buen recibimiento. Mis compañeros siempre han estado ahí apoyándome, dándome ánimo, eh, acogiéndome a que me sienta mejor cada día y me siento bien agradecido con ellos. La todo. Pelea. Me gusta todo. No tengo una favorita todavía. Bueno, ellos han estado tirando bien, ¿sabes? No te puedo dar una referencia ahorita porque estos son juegos de práctica. Todavía no, no estamos en competencia y yo no sé si si sí, ellos están dando el buen por, el 100%, todavía siento que no puedo darte una referencia sobre ellos. La verdad es que, como te digo, tengo que esperar a que sea la competencia, porque ahorita es muy temprano para yo decirte cuál es la diferencia. Mi punto positivo, bueno, que soy eh, un jugador agresivo, sale al terreno a jugar 100%, no importa lo que pasa en el juego y siempre me mantengo con la fe y, y la certeza de que vamos a ganar el juego. Bueno, eh, la meta principal creo que es ayudar al equipo a ganar muchos juegos, que estemos en la postemporada y que logremos lo más importante que es ser campeones y pues a los fanáticos que tengan mucha fe en nosotros, nosotros siempre vamos a dar el buen 100% para ganar muchos juegos y lograr lo que tanto queremos, ser campeones. Deseo lo mejor a ti y los éxitos este año, en esta temporada. Gracias.